is your favorite Christmas station. This station don't play the same music. Christmas. Joy FM. Music feels just so good when you're tuned in to your one and only station. Zambia's most loved radio station. Joy FM. That's why we're going back to the moon. We're going to boom and we're going to boom. We're going back to the moon. 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 We're still on now the joyful lunch right here on a Wednesday as we are still celebrating women in music and today we decided to get our interaction with uh, Bombshell live on radio just to get find out a few things about a current venue song and other stuff right here on uh, the 27th of uh, January 2021. Let's get hold of her and let's get find a few things right here on Joy FM. Good afternoon, how are you doing? Afternoon. How are you doing? I'm good, how are you doing? I'm good. Yeah, so we've been talking about this interview for a while now, but uh, we had to do this uh, for your fans. People have been asking so much and uh, trying, to, trying to get find out a few uh, uh, information on uh, what you've been up to. Okay. Yeah, so tell us, uh, what has Bombshell been up to of late? Well, been busy working on my album, a lot of projects being signed under Nexus, they're keeping us pretty busy. Mm. And as it is right now, I'm shooting lockdown video, you know, making sure we practice our social distancing and mas- masking up and uh, making sure we sanitize on set. Mm. It's crazy. A lot of work. Yeah. With so, this, this new norm. Okay. So have you observed something about yourself? It's like people are now getting to adapt to your type of vibe music that you're dropping right now. Uh, I don't know, the club version type? Uh, what, what, what are you calling the type of music that you're doing right now? I've, I've gone into happy music, man. I mean, look at the world as it is right now. There's so much darkness going on, so much sadness, you know. So mm. I figured, why don't I do some music that can make people dance from home <laughs> since people mm. can't go to the class no more. Mm. So basically, that's what I'm into. And obviously, there's an album coming up as well. Obviously, there'll be a little bit of some twist in it, but I just want to make people dance. I want to make people move. That's what I want to make people feel. Mm. So what's the, what's the title of the album? And also, who are we looking forward to? Uh, who are you working with in your album, coming album, incoming album? Uh, well, I've got some international artists. Um, you know, obviously, already of the likes of Scales. I've um, mm. got another international artist who I'm not going to mention. I'd rather keep it as a, a surprise. Mm-hmm. I have some Zambian artists as well. There's definitely no way I'd leave home and not work with my brothers or my sisters. Mm. And uh, yeah, I have not come up with a title yet, but we're definitely going to figure out something that's going to be perfect. Mm. But, so, yeah. so do we still expect more of your songs produced by Easy? Because the other day I was just talking about how you guys, the chemistry is just on point. Most of the songs that yeah. you, have, you have done with Easy, I feel like he knows you now. Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. <laughs> so tell us about that. How has it been? Your working relationship with uh, Easy, the producer? It's been amazing. He's a very down to earth brother, and a lot of jokes. And we both were both very similar people, so mm. we click very well. It's been beautiful, and uh, definitely you should expect more work with, from me and him. Amazing. Let's talk about uh, lockdown. Uh, a couple of songs that we have heard. People have been dropping uh, coronavirus, COVID nineteen songs with a different vibe. And you come with another different vibe right there. Tell us, how did it all begin? And just you just saying, I want to do something in regards with what is happening. Uh, well, like I said, I mean, it's lockdown period. People cannot live the way they used to meet before. People are not free anymore. People can't go partying anymore. So me and Easy feels like, look, why don't we do something? Why don't we hit them with another banger? After Fukunyuka, I was like, let's give them another banger. And especially that now, there's all this going on. Let's come up with a beat that'll make people jive and feel good about the situation that's going on. Not that we're celebrating Corona, but we're just celebrating the fact that we can keep ourselves safe, stay at home, and still dance to the beat. Mm-hmm. So that's when he was like, you know what? I have an idea, and I'm like, cool, let's do this. And also, since there was also that talk of, uh, you know, uh, when I was voted, Google voted me as the seventh uh, rapper. Yeah, yeah, I saw and, that. Uh, yes, yes. So there's a lot of people that did not agree to it. So it all just fell in the right time for me to also just put in some bars on my song because I mean as much as there will be people who will backlash and not agree there's also still the people that believe in me my day ones my fans the shells you know what I mean mm-hmm. so I was like you know what I think it's time now to be a little bit more lyrical mm-hmm. let me let me do something that you dance to 
but it's, let me also throw in some, you know, lyrics and uh, whoever is rap, you know, who understands rap will hear the punchline. Mm. And that's exactly how we all did it. Mm. How long does it take you to get to write the uh, entire song? Uh, do you find it so hard sometimes or feel like uh, it's not working out, then you go to the studio another day? Sorry, you didn't get that? Like, for example, how long does it take you for you to get to have a complete song? For example, Lockdown. How long did it take you for you to get to uh, record the song? Actually, it didn't take too long because everything just happened too quick. Uh, before you knew it, uh, Google had that stuff going on. So we actually did that song like in uh, two days out there. Oh, amazing. Amazing. Let's let's talk about uh, your uh, uh, signing with uh, Nexus. I'm pretty sure there are so many pending questions from the public out there. What made Bombshell to take up that step? Well, these guys approached me and uh, everything they were saying and everything they were promising is something like it was, they were telling me about me having my dream come true. I mean, all the past years I've worked by myself, you know. I have done everything for myself. And here comes a whole label telling me, we're going to do this for you, we're going to do that for you. And there are people who believe in a dream, you know what I mean? They want to help artists uh, leave their dreams. And uh, obviously, I didn't just jump into it just like that. Um, I had to like listen to more what they have to say, what do they have to offer, what are they putting out. And honestly speaking, it was all blessed. It was all beautiful. And I went for it. And so far, so good. Everything has been amazing because Nexus really believes in their artists and they're about making people become better than them, what they have been. So they're about taking us to greater heights. Mm. So exactly that's what i'm in okay interesting and you're in max remember talk to your fans right now we're locked on and also in regards with uh, the pandemic a uh, few people still believe that i don't know if uh, you've seen it happening some people say there's no covid 19 exactly and others are uh, still doubting i've been in public transports where you find yourself wearing a mask other people don't want to they concerned. don't want they don't still believe that maybe you as yeah. bombshell as well no, no no okay first and foremost people need to stop this thing of thinking this disease is only for the wealthy people or whatever it's a disease it's a pandemic it's everybody you know what i mean because i've heard somebody in a shop before say i've met in the classroom exactly and this guy yeah. because the guy walks up to him and he's like ah, can you wear your mask uh. sadly i couldn't say anything I could say, my my friend come on mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's just about them. I mean, yes, I don't like these moves. I mean, you get to mm -hmm. sanitize all the time. You gotta mm -hmm. wash your hands. You have to now start drinking hot water. You have to start steaming your body now. Start smelling of lemons and herbs. On your mouth. How, how, sorry to cut you short. How is the steaming going on, though? I saw you post something <laughs> on your status. <laughs> and someone has to bath. <laughs> but anyways, tell us, have you tried it out as bombshell? You steaming. How is it going so far? I'm steaming every single day. You don't understand. Oh my! Even this morning, I steamed. Oh I am my. so paranoid. Oh my! <laughs> I'm that person who would take caution, like hundred percent. Because oh when my. I go around, I put a spray. It's not the, you know, it's not the liquid hand sanitizer. I have a spray. Okay. So when I'm moving around, I'll be spraying around, like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, okay, that. yeah, interesting, interesting. Anyways, uh, bombshell in your remix. Uh, anything that you like to talk about to your fans? Anything that you like to share that you felt like uh, your fans need to be up to date? Okay. Uh, first and foremost, I want to tell my fans I love them. I love my haters too. They mm. hate me. Yeah. The haters, the fans, the lovers, the friends, the family, everybody, yourself. You make me. You mm. know. And uh, I want to tell everybody else to take care of themselves. You got to stay safe. I mean, at the moment, we're all living by the grace of God, True. to be honest. I, I mean, before it was about hearing other people dying. We're hearing about Corona in other countries, in mm -hmm. inter international areas. You know what I mean? Yeah. Now it's home, it's here. And before you know it, it's your, it's your friend, it's your family member. It's somebody who's passed on from the, from the Corona. So I don't know what more people need to be told to, be to, to actually realize that this thing is here and it's serious. Mm -hmm. taking people's lives and it's about yourself you have to take care of yourself there's also carriers so mm -hmm. we all just gotta take care of ourselves you can be a carrier and not take care of yourself get home and maybe there's somebody who's vulnerable there there's the kids there's our grandparents there's the older people mm -hmm. there are people with the underlying uh, issues and you give it to them and you lose a loved one so mm -hmm. It's as good as this. We gotta take care of ourselves and put God first. That's mm -hmm. what it is. All right. Thank you very much, Bombshell, for a few minutes right here. Coming up is uh, Lockdown, still playing Thank right here. So much. And it's doing very well on our countdown on top 20. Uh, I, I, I don't know if you know about that, but yeah, it's trending.
And I do, I do oppose that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank nah, you very much. You, man. All right, have an amazing one. All right. Okay, so that's Bombshell right there. I'm Fumukazi. Doing amazing work, man. Trust me. And uh, so much to talk about. So like I always make mention, man, uh, coronavirus doesn't move on its own. It's moved by people. Us, the people, are the ones who move it. No one should lie, man. Let's go straight to Bombshell. Lockdown. Easy. I'm looking forward to the album, man. An international artist? Oh, my. Bombshell. Every time I drop a verse, I move bodies like I drop a hearse. A big fat rubber band in my purse. If you want chat to me, Liza Jumbo, Mr. Salute Queen Cutie, but beauty. I still shoot when I'm footing, I'm footing. Cute girl and I'm footing, my booty. I've always been a twisted, they hit no vicuti. Drip, drip on a society, don't ya? I bunny man, I go ahead, never gone ya. Drip, drip on a society, don't ya? Tat ting, tamaranga, gabonia.